This quick guide will teach you how Photoshop can be used to watermark multiple photos in bulk. To avoid failure and unnecessary time loss, please pay close attention to the entire process. For this guide, we are using Adobe Photoshop CS6 version 13. We are not sure if earlier versions of Adobe Photoshop have this capability. You don't have to use version 13, you can use any version released after version 13. The good thing about version 13 is that it is compatible with Windows XP and Windows 7 as well. Create a separate folder and put the photos you want to watermark into that folder. We recommend making a copy of photos you want to watermark. If you make a mistake during the process and you save changes, you will need to spend time correcting it separately. In this guide, we are not going to cover how to make a photo to use as a watermark. But there are a few things you should know about watermark photo. If the text or logo on the photo you want to use as a watermark photo is in a square size, you can use any image. But if you want only the text or logo to be visible on the photos, you will need a photo with a transparent background. Image extension must be PNG for watermark. You can also use the web image extension. The background of photos with the PNG or web extensions remains transparent after saving or exporting. Decide the number of photos to be watermarked based on your computer's capabilities. Do not select a set of photos to be watermarked that goes beyond the device's capacity. If you have a device with average system resources, watermark photos between 50 to 100 in one go. Otherwise, your PC may hang or crash. Launch Adobe Photoshop. Open any photo in Photoshop. Press Alt and F9 keys to open the Actions panel. In the Actions tab, create a folder with a name of your choice. We'll name it Test. Next step is creating an action. We'll name it Put Watermark. You may give it any name, it doesn't matter what name you give it. Click on Record to start recording your actions. The next steps are importing the watermarked photo and choosing the desired size and the exact place where you want to put the photo and then saving the photo. Do not click on any irrelevant place in the meantime. It might not work otherwise. Go to the File menu and click on Place to Import or Open Watermark Photo. Please choose the appropriate location for the image and adjust its size as needed. Once you are satisfied with the changes, press the Enter key and save the file as a JPEG image format. After saving, stop the recording. Go to the File menu and hover your mouse pointer Automate and open Batch option. In the Play section, choose the set or folder we have created earlier if not already selected. In the Source section, choose Folder from the drop-down menu. Right beneath it, click on Choose option to select the folder with photos you want to put watermarks on. After this step, check mark the last two options. You can use the second option if you have photos stored in subfolders. In the Destination section, select the Folder option from the drop-down menu. Then click on Choose to select the folder where your copy of Photoshop will save watermarked photos. Do not forget to checkmark Override Action Save as Commands. After Output Folder Selection, from the drop-down menu, select Document Name and Extension in capital letters. Leave other things as default and click OK to kickstart watermarking your collection of photos in bulk. Photos have been watermarked perfectly and successfully with Photoshop Automate. If you don't find yourself good at following these instructions and want an easy way to watermark photos in bulk, we suggest using Wonderfox Photo Watermark. We don't say that it is the best option. But Wonderfox Photo Watermark will do the job. Visit SoftSuggestor. Com for programs like Wonderfox Photo Watermark if you are not satisfied with it.
Find the link in the description box to download Wonderfox Photo Watermark. We hope Photoshop Automate or third-party photo watermark software has been useful to you. Hopefully, you have managed to watermark your set of multiple photos with minimum efforts with ease. If we fail to cover any crucial points in the guide, you are most welcome to contact us using the comment box. We will try our best to help you. Leave your questions, suggestions, and feedback in the comment section. More info and download links can be found on softsuggester.com. Subscribe to Software Geek for more useful videos and ring bell button for the latest updates.